wild, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Coach made a call. Uh, you know, people just got to do the job, really, man. You know, they good throw by Dad, good catch by him. But uh, if everybody just do their job, nah, that play would have been stopped easily. But uh, <sighs> that <laughs> my plan was that blow. Were you in trail technique on that? Hello everyone, this is Al Kabir, the analyst, and today, before I begin, I want to salute Baldy for the clip. I want to salute him. Um, look, man, everybody kept asking, what happened on that third and 30? Did Slay get burned? Was it on Josiah Scott? Oh, who was this on, man? Who was this on? Like I said, I just want to salute Baldy for the clip. Let me move myself out the way and want me to minimize myself, and we're going to see what happened on this play we're definitely going to see let me move myself over here and um look man sorry about that but man i think it was on josiah scott personally personally but let's get into it okay oh um, so here we go third and 30 first of all let's rewind it because I have no idea what this defense is. I, I really don't. I don't know what Jonathan Gannon called on this. It, it looks sloppy from the start. But let's watch as the play develop. Okay. All right. So Josiah Scott is dropping back. So obviously, he is safety. He is safety. He's supposed to be looking out for Slay. Slay supposed to be, you know, watching the flats or they try to, you know, throw like a 15, 20 yarder. Slay will be there. But T.Y. Hilton, this is a go route. This is a straight go route to T.Y. Hilton, right? So let's rewind it back. Now let's look at Josiah Scott. Josiah Scott turns his hip to the inside guy. I'm not sure why he do that. That was a deadly cost to this team he turns his hip to the inside guy but as you see the play develop you're going to realize there's another safety watching that inside guy if he decides to you know deep post or anything like that why josiah scott is turning his hips i don't know i don't know why is he turning his hips no josiah scott you don't do that all right josiah scott still has the opportunity to make a play on this ball he still do. And that's just that's just bad football by Josiah Scott. It's really bad football. I don't think that's on Slay. Slay, you can see after the play, is obviously pissed off. Obviously pissed off. But here it go from this angle. Um, double team on Sweat. Hassan Reddick almost get there. He launched it up. And from this angle, it just looked like Slay got beat. But from the, like I could say, nosebleed angle. You could obviously tell that was on Josiah Scott, man. Not Slay. Not Slay at all. So, when I was hearing that in my live stream, like, oh, it, it, it's, it's Slay. It's Slay, right? I kept hearing that. I'm like, well, that's one of the things where you got to watch the All-22. You got to watch the All-22 because we really can't tell by the television view. We can't. It's hard to make a decision on that. But by that nosebleed, whatever we want to call it, that was on Josiah Scott. He obviously supposed to have the safety position. Obviously. Obviously, man. But my guy Slate taking a lot of heat. I don't think that's on him. But hey, man, what do you think? How do you feel? Do you feel like it's still on Darius Slate on that third and 30? Third and 30? I don't think that's on Slate. Based on the all 22, like I said, salute to Baldy for the clip. But this is Al Kabir, the analyst. Ghost.